Okay, let's talk about consistency. I have not been consistent on YouTube, but I have been consistent in regards to promoting my, excuse my French, my shit. <laughs> and I gained 20 subscribers and... We are back at it, YouTube. How you doing? I have not been consistent. You want to know why? Because I just moved. And, yeah. And you will get a apartment tour. Maybe January, February. Okay? Uh -huh. And happy 2022. Uh, thank you for all the new subscribers. I truly, truly appreciate you. And 2022 is about to be one of the best years of our lives. And you better manifest that stuff. Oh. And yeah. I will see you guys very, very soon. Probably, I I guess say it. We got moving silence. <laughs> okay, let's talk about consistency. I have not been consistent on YouTube. But I have been consistent in regards to promoting my, excuse my French, my shit. <laughs> and I gained 20 subscribers. And listen, from October 2021. And a life lesson in regards to if you want something, you will go get it. So, yeah. Ladies, don't settle for no dude if he is saying, woo, 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 let's be friends, but let's, let's get a little nookie on the side, get out of here. You don't deserve it, ladies. And men, if she is saying like, oh, well, can you buy me this? Can you buy me that? Where's the nookie? It's like, no. <laughs> but no, but no. Um... Just be consistent with yourself because at the end of the day, it's only you. You got to only depend on you because some people might let you down. Some people you don't need to be codependent on because you are you. And I can't believe I have 20 more subscribers from October. And look at God. And believe in yourself. And nobody else will. Hello. <laughs> Hello. I am living proof right here. Uh -huh. So, yeah. Never doubt yourself. Never doubt yourself. Because you deserve it. You deserve. You deserve what you believe that you deserve. One of the things, people who have good advice never take their own advice. And I had to learn to take my own advice. And... I have to keep doing me and work on me all day, every day. Because my mouth can get reckless. And I had to learn to reflect back, not only for that person, because I know my mouth can get reckless and I know I can make people cry because of my mouth. And sometimes I kind of wanted to do that because that's my defense mechanism. But also, at the end of the day, I'm going to feel bad because I genuinely don't want to make people feel bad. I just want to make people feel bad because they hurt me. And that's not the way to go. And I have to, I'm working on in regards to communication and how I present myself to others. So, that was kind of like an ego death. That's kind of like way beyond but I have to, sometimes you just got to reflect on you and reflect on, and you got to reflect on what makes you you and what type of childhood trauma that you have to deal with, what type of defense mechanisms that you deal with, what type of things that you feel you need to work on. And a lot of people can't do that. So if you ever do some self-reflection and think and try to and try to take accountability 
you're on the right path. And because that's hard to do. That's hard to do. You sometimes you just have to have an ego death. And some people just aren't capable. But I had to have an ego death because at the end of the day, I had to live for myself. I am in this own body. I am my own body. I'm going to die alone. I came in this world alone. I'm going to die alone. So it is what it and is. And listen, if you have to cut off some people, cut them off. Especially if you feel like you have an inkling that they're no good for you. And they're not at your highest level. They don't want you to be at your highest level because, listen, a lot of people want to see you do good, but not better than them. And it's sad, but it is what it is. And listen, I've never been no hater ever in my life. If I see you doing good, and then I'm going to still clap for you because at the end of the day, ain't no bitterness in my heart. Now, is there jealousy? Like, maybe like an inch. But then I look back and see, like, what did they have to do to, what is it called? Uh, no, I know you guys probably know what I'm saying. But they had to, what did they have to sacrifice? What did they have to sacrifice to be at that level? And if, even, if, even if they did not have to sacrifice a lot, that's not my problem. That's not my business. Because at the end of the day, I know. I'm going to do something in this world. Do you, baby? <laughs> Two years ago, mm -mm, you would not even see me doing this type of video. That's all God. And people might make fun of it, make laugh of it, whatever. Hey, do you. Because I don't care. People will try to provoke you. People will poke at you. Just to see your reaction because sometimes at the end of the day, they think so highly of you. If you poke back, then they think, oh, I won. Mm -mm. <laughs> Not today. <laughs> Not today. I had to go through trials and tribulations in regards to that because I dealt with family members who tried to provoke me. Ex-friends who did ex-buddies, ex-boyfriends. Because I dealt with a lot of insecure people. Because I was insecure. And I know some people are watching from my past. And I truly hope that you find some goodness within your heart. Because listen, you're not going to get clout off of me. <laughs> I can't believe I'm even saving I can't believe I'm even saying this. That you're going to get clout off of me. But you're not. You're not. Forget about other people. Stop trying to be in competition with other people. Because if you're in competition with other people, you already lost the fight. Because truthfully, those people who are you are who you are trying to be in competition with you are not in competition with you. Because they ain't not worried about you. <laughs> That's the kicker. <laughs> I did not find the inner strength within myself. I probably either would have been dead or would have been a baby mama of two baby daddies. I always thank God every day. Every day. And I just hope people, especially now, because a lot of things are going on in, excuse me, in the universe. I just wish that people would just reflect on themselves. <sighs> Maybe one day. But I'm not Captain Save a Hope. I'm only Captain Saving Myself. <laughs> Cause I've been shitted on, I've been played with, I've been talked about, I've been lied on. I'm good. And I cannot wait to meet my my soul family. I cannot wait. I can't wait to meet my real family. See y'all.